now let's see how we can customize footer in the woodmart theme so here is the footer so to customize the footer you can over over edit with elementor and here you will see footer one column dark so just open this and here you see the first column of this footer that you can customize using this thing using this option and the other options and the other things you can customize with another method that i will tell you so now go to the website and here we can upload the new logo and here we can add a description of the store that currently i'm out adding you can just update it over here and here you can see the address phone number and fax you can update it or remove it if you want so just click on publish and now let's go back to the store click refresh and here you can see the updated information and these things for these things you need to go to Walmart and here you need to go to footer currently five columns are showing and to change the content of the other four columns you need to go to widgets so for that just scroll and here you will see appearance and go to widgets over here and here you can scroll down and here you will see all the footer columns and here you can see the first column which is the html block that is that we have already edited so this one footer column 2 is showing the recent post so if you want to change them just click on it and you can change them if you want otherwise you can also remove this and you can you can remove this from here so from here you can just add a new item and similarly for these columns similarly for these other columns you can update the menu here you can see a navigation menu card footer menu useful links is showing so if you want to add any page over here or you want to remove any page you can just go to appearance menu and select this menu and you can make changes to that similarly for this footer column 5 you can update anything that you want from the appearance and menu so just let's go to these menus and see how we can customize them and here we have the privacy policy return terms contact us latest news or sitemap but the links are not added so we need to add the correct link so let's see if we can add a new page to our store so here we have returns and terms and conditions so let's see if we can create a new page for them so for to create a new page we can hover to pages and we will click on add new page so just click on that here you can write returns you can publish the page and here you can write the return policy so you can save the page after that you can use chat apt or any return policy generator for this or you can write your own custom return policy so after creating the page you can just copy the link of the page and go to appearm menus and here you can add the link for that and click on save similarly for the other menus you can create their pages and you can add their links in them now let's go to footer menu or store and here are the locations that are showing in the footer so here we are Close this and here you can scroll here you can see the locations that are showing so i will so you can add the location or you can remove all of these if you don't need so let's just remove the other ones now let's go to the store and refresh and here you can see the updated location and now let's edit this menu so i want this to be top profile So I can add the link for that. I don't want to use 
add this menu so let's remove remove this one i will keep the contact us and remove this purchase team and here i also want to add another page that is about us so let's add this page click on save now go back and refresh and here you can see the updated menus and now the final thing how you can change this credit and these logos so you can hover to Woodmart theme over here and go to theme settings and select footer over here again and now we have set up these things and now let's click on this copyright and here you see the copyright so here if you want to add any website link you can update this website link and i want to go all this now check the store and here you can see the updated and now let's see we can change this logo finally so to update this logo go back to the theme setting and here is the text that you have updated and here is the image link that is showing over here if you want to remove this just remove it otherwise you can update this image link you can upload new image in the media tab over here and just update the link and click on save changes and it will update this thing so that's how you can customize the footer in your woodmart theme if you have any question just reach me out on my website via the contact form all the contact details are provided in the description and i will also provide the links for the web hosting that i recommend and i personally use in the description of the video if you will purchase the web hosting or theme or anything using the link provided in the description then i will receive a little bit of commission that help me create these type of free videos for you so that's it for the video like this video leave a comment and subscribe to my channel for more related videos see you next time